Hey everybody, my name is Suzanne Bel Belhowski. I'm your independent sensi consultant. Thank you for watching my channel. Today, I come to you a little bit late, um, but I am going to be reviewing the scent of the month for March 2021. Um, without giving you away too much. Um, the scent is a bakery scent, which I was so excited about. Um, I just haven't gotten to share it with you yet. I've been working quite a bit. I do night shifts, so... I'm always tired, um, but um, I think first I'll start with the scent. Um, it is called Pink Sugar Sugarberry Mint, and it is a beautiful bubblegum kind of pink wax. And the really cool thing right now Sensi's doing with all their new packaging is on the back they are putting all the, um, what do you call these, scent note categories. So there's the bakery... Um, they have the woods, the fresh, um, the spice, the floral, um, and the citrus. So pretty cool. I love that new packaging. It just adds a little extra flair on there. So, um, that's the front of the package. Like I said, a nice pink wax. Um, let's go into the top notes of this are plum, raspberry, strawberry, mid notes, are peppermint, snowdrop, and peony, and the base notes are sugar, coconut, vanilla, and fresh aracord. I still have yet to learn what fresh aracord, you know, smells like, um, but I'm sure it's somewhere in there. And the description is, plump raspberry is delightfully dusted with, with sugar and the sweetest hint of peppermint. So I think right off the bat, you're going to think that you're going to get raspberry. Um, I, for some reason, thought I was going to get strawberry. I don't know why. Um, but when I smell it, let me just open one here. Right off the top for me, I feel like I get strawberry and not like strawberry rose. Um, it's more like kind of like sugared strawberry to me, but not sugared strawberry in the way that like this has a, this does have a minty note to it. Not strong minty, but like a candied mint. I think for me, the mint is throwing it off of a bakery scent for me. Um, and I think that's not why it's my, not my favorite. I haven't warmed this. I meant to warm this before I shared it, but I haven't yet. So I definitely get the fruit right up front, like that, um, the berry note. And then I do get the mint. I don't get any coconut, any, um, I don't really get any vanilla either from this. It's mostly for me fruit and then like a touch of mint on it. So it's nice. And I feel like when you warm this, it's going to transform a little bit. So, um, that's what that smells like. Um, if anybody doesn't know if you're a consultant, um, and you do get the scent and warmer of the month kits, you do get them for a bit of a discount. And what they come with is, I believe it's 50 of these, um, flyers for the scent of the month to give out to your, um, customers or potential customers, you get 72 rub and sniff stickers, which I stick these on my, um, samples just cause they act as labels. And I really like that. You get one party tester to add to your collection. Um, and you get the room spray in pink sugar berry mint and you get nine, bars. We are back to just doing the bars. It was for a while, I believe it was five of bars and one brick. Um, I really enjoyed the bricks just cause I would take the bricks and melt those down for samples and then save um, my other bars for, um, me to use just like normal, but either way you're getting the same amount of wax. So that is the scent. Um, now going into the warmer. So the warmer is definitely like a spring theme. It's called birds of a feather. It says a roosting bird nestles down as if it's warming egg, as if it's warming its eggs while you warm your favorite fragrance. The white porcelain glows thanks to an led light highlighting the or ornate details and ensuring more than just bird watchers will flock to this warmer. So when I first saw it, I was like, uh, like I'm not a huge bird kind of fan, but, um, 
And one thing I really wish about this was it wasn't an LED light. I wish it was a, this is an element warmer with an LED light in it to light up the bird. I just wish you could switch a light bulb around to light up the warmer in a different color because um, it would just give it so much more, you know, options, especially when you see a white warmer. It'd be, how fun would it be to have, you know, like a purple bird or a purple warmer, but um, it's still beautiful in its own right. So I'm going to get it out here and show you what it looks like. I like the uniqueness of this and the design of it being an element warmer. I think you can kind of do more with them. So this is what it looks like. So the LED light is inside where this bird is, and this is where you would put your, um, your wax. And it says no more than four cubes in here. It is quite a, a deep dish. Um, and then that is how you know it's an element warmer. So this dish just sits right on top of that heating plate. Um, I'm going to plug it in and show you exactly what it looks like. It's quite pretty, and you kind of have to love, like, just the simple elegance of the porcelain white, I think is really nice. Give me one second here, guys. It doesn't want to work with me. There we go. Okay, are we ready? So this is what it looks like. I'm gonna turn my light off here. So this is what it looks like when it is dark or not on. And this is what it looks like on. So it is really pretty, hey? and. You see when the light shines through in the nest here, it actually looks like a nest. I really, really actually like that. How pretty. How just simple and pretty is that? The light just gives it texture and dimension, I feel. The only part that doesn't light up is the dish, but there's no reason for the dish to light up, so... I love it how cute okay and so one more thing turn my light back on is I'll tell you the prices so the prices in Canada for the bar in March are gonna be 720 room spray is gonna be 990 and then scent circle is gonna be 360 it's 10% off for the month of March um, and the warmer instead of $66 will be $59.40. So if you are the type of person that loves a spring warmer, this is going to be your warmer. It's pretty, it's not overly huge, and it does have a lighting feature to it for being an element warmer. So, And it's nice and dim, nothing that's going to um, keep you up at night if you put it in your bedroom. So. Anyway, that's all I have for you guys. If you enjoyed this video, please like it. As always, if you're new, please subscribe, and I will talk to you all soon. Bye!